Hey guys, over here uh, at the East Side campus out in Brighton today, Jeff Moss here from Diverse Dimensions. And I wanted to get with you guys, I wanna talk about macros a little bit and macros and, and the usage of macros. So we develop macros as well. Polyworks has a handful of macros as well. And we love using them. It makes the workflow easier on certain occasions. So what I wanna show you guys today is how to navigate to the, uh, the technical support zone um, on the Polyworks site and then do a download of a macro and just show where that goes. So we're gonna have another video that will show how to upload the video to your, uh, to your toolbar or how to use a macro that's already out there. But this is just a simple one to show you guys that the macros exist and where we can grab them. So come on into the Internet Explorer here. I've got Chrome up. Chrome, here we got it. So Google kind of pops up here. I've got this in a metric quick launch right here up in my toolbar, which is pretty nice. Innovmetric.com seems to be pretty close to my one of my favorite websites on the snow.com. We'll talk about that at a later time. Okay, so Innovmetric, here we go. So once I tie into the website here, I've got access to the technical support zone here. Okay, let me click on that a second. If you don't have access to that, go ahead and talk to the boys at Polyworks and get that, um, get that up and running. I've got everything I need here to log in. If you've got trouble with the login, just go ahead again, reach out to Polyworks and they'll get you, uh, get you back up and running. Once you get to this zone right here, this technical support zone, navigate up to here, the macro zone. If I click on the macro zone, it just takes me into this little area here. Now notice here when I'm in the macro zone, I'll scroll down a little bit. I've got a handful of macros that are already out there that are published or that are authored by Polyworks. Handful of them here and just wanted to let you know too, we also do custom, uh, custom macros. So if you are in need of a macro uh, specific to your workflow, we'd love to help you out with that. So reach out anytime for that. Um, what I'm gonna do here though is I'm just gonna grab one that's already out there and I'll grab this one, this mesh from two polylines. Notice this though too, the version, um, the version back here is saying that if you've got a version of Polyworks prior to 2019 version IR10, this macro will not run. So as long as you're this version or later, you should be in good shape. So if I click on him, this is kind of cool. Look what comes up. You've got a description of the macro and here's the file over here. I'll scroll down just to show that a little bit more. So if I was to grab this, uh, this macro here, notice the, the extension is PW macro. If I click onto him, it's just gonna do a download for me and that ends up in my downloads directory. So I could show you that here a second. If I go to my file explorer and run over to my downloads and sort by the date, here we go. I've got that right here. This is the macro that just got downloaded in and then I can start to implement that into my Polyworks. So we're gonna have a different video on that here coming up too. So it will show you how to grab that macro that you've downloaded and put it onto your toolbar and you, uh, it will show you how to use it as well. So again, we do custom curriculum or custom curriculum for training as well as custom macros. So feel free to reach out at any time and we'd love to help you guys get up to that level.